Hot news. Boris invokes Article 16 and revokes NIP. Ireland trade freezes completely. A Brexit controversy looms over tents this morning as Michael Martin will speak on Northern Ireland's trade deals for the first time since arriving in the U.S. The Republic of Ireland has never been a friend of the U.K., although over the years thousands of Irish people have come to this country and taken our jobs and our benefits. The worst export they make to the UK are the marauding gangs of so-called travelers. Have the patties started to follow the EU law on minimum corporation tax yet? If so, when are the techs moving to the UK? Speaking to various people in the UK, I sense a feeling that the country is better when you had some food and could afford heating. Pre-Brexit days, basically. The protocol and plan could have been implemented, so everyone just got on with their lives and worked. But the EU urinal has deliberately twisted problems into everyone else's lives for the, just for the spite. This is a fact, so a new agreement is needed, where it spells out the EU urinal is not to be trusted. World Trade ASAP. Scrap the Good Friday Agreement. Time Irish sorted themselves out. Became one nation. In or out of the EU or UK. Up to them. Yet another nail in the EU Free Trade Agreement that nobody wants. WTO, here we come. Are you sure you want even worse food shortages, price rises, and economic underperformance than we already have? Looks like we are heading for Article 16 and the eventual revocation of NIP. The EU, Ireland, nor the US can dictate the terms for handing over Northern Ireland to the EU. Their sensible and pragmatic solution is a cracked record. Alignment to our standards in perpetuity. Um, no. Not a big deal. Just to destroy the EU deal and NIP, which would have done in the first place, saving the UK billions of pounds. With our woke judiciary, many still in the back pocket of the EU, they will probably uphold the protocol. Just wait and see. Screw these terrorist scum and nuke the deal in Southern Ireland. Better idea, get out of Northern Ireland and leave Ireland to the Irish. If the will was there, trading arrangements could be introduced and that it didn't impede free movement of goods and people. Unfortunately, it isn't. Doesn't he realize yet that he is just being used by the EU? As for Biden and the Irish dopes in Congress, don't they realize there has always been a border in Ireland for things like VAT, etc.? And the GFA has no mention of a border. How about you? What do you think about this issue? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section and we can discuss. If you find the video good, please don't regret one like and share them. I will continuously update the latest news in the next videos. Please subscribe to the channel so you don't miss it. Thank you.